Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Uh, today's video is going to be my updated apartment tour. I know there was a few people that wanted to see an updated apartment tour. And um, so I've been in here for like a little over three weeks now. And um, I haven't yet got everything that I want in here. I haven't got it the way I want it completely yet. But I have it uh, together enough to show you guys what I've done with it so far. And um, yeah, so like if you like this video, please like it. Um, thumbs it up, comment, rate, and subscribe. And um, I hope you enjoyed the video. So yeah, this is my first apartment. Um, of You know, with me and my fiance, this is our first apartment. I've had houses in the past before. I lived in houses, but um, this is our first apartment together as a couple. And, um, yeah, so I thought I would show you guys what it looks like. So, um, I know I did an apartment tour, uh, for when we first moved in and it was like nothing in it, <laughs> but now we've done a little bit more. We have our, our living room furniture and now, um, I want to show you guys what it looks like. So, okay, here we go. So this is the front door. This is our front door. Um, and then we have like a light switch right there. <laughs> And then um, when you first come in, you just see um, this tan mat that we got from the dollar store. It was like three bucks. Um, we also have one right in, outside of our door for when guests come. Um, one of our rules is, you know, when you come in, um, you take your shoes. And they take your shoes off before they come in. Um, and they put it, they take their shoes off on the mat right outside the door. And then when they come in, they put their shoes um, right on this mat inside. Or they can put it in this black um, shoe rack that we have or in the closet where we keep our coats and um, hoodies and shoes and all that. It's pretty dark in there. Um, I apologize for that because every time I decide to film is really late at night. Right now it's uh, around 6 o'clock so please excuse the lighting. <laughs> So yeah, so if you've seen my first apartment tour when I first came in, you might have seen this and um, it's not a washer and dryer or anything like that. I think it's a water heater where our heart, a water heater is. Um, we don't have a washer and dryer in this uh, apartment unit, but there is one in the building. So uh, we don't have to go to a uh, laundromat. So, you know, I... Um, which I like, you know, not having to go to a laundry mat. And then you come over here and then you see uh, the side of our couch. This is my flats right there. And then um, a laundry bag because I'm doing laundry right now. And then our couch and then, sorry if it's shaky too. <laughs> um, so there's our TV and then on the side of our TV is our uh, mini fridge. We used to have it in our room, but we put it out in the open for guests. So, and then that's our balcony. So I'm gonna walk over here, try not to be too shaky. So yeah, this is our balcony. And um, I planned out the balcony, um, but I, uh, there's, there's uh, my neighbors out there and they're having a party and all that. So I don't wanna really um, go out there right now. Um, but there's our TV and um, yeah, we just, it's just a regular <laughs> uh, flat screen TV we got from Walmart. and. Um, our TV stand that has all of our games and our console on it and then our mini fridge is from Black & Decker um, Walmart and it was uh, it was really cheap it's like 50 bucks and oh yeah the TV is a 32 inch and I believe we paid 150 for it um, Black Friday and the stand was free and it also came from Walmart and then this is our couch and it's a L-shaped sectional couch. And I believe I got this from Aaron's um, a while back. And um, I got it for a really great deal. I believe it cost like $1,400 originally for just the, the couch alone. It came with an ottoman, and but I lost the ottoman. And, you know, moving throughout the years. So I lost the ottoman and um, it came with a nightstand two nightstands ottoman and two lamps but i didn't i never got the lamps or the nightstands i just had the ottoman and with the ottoman and the couch it's like around two thousand dollars but with the couch alone it's just fourteen hundred and um i got it for five hundred dollars because it when i first got it it came damaged 
and um but i was able to fix it with a hot glue gun and um saved a whole lot of money so i forget what the name of the couch is because i got it so long ago but um if i remember it i'll put it down in the description so if you if you're interested in this couch i don't know if they still sell it or not but um you could you could check on their website um i got it like two years they probably still sell it but um i'm not sure um so yeah it comes with eight pillows and um two of those pillows are silver three black ones and then three black and white ones now i do really love this couch this couch is super comfortable um but the one thing that i really don't like about this couch is the pillows these black and white ones they um i'm all for like zebra print looking um things but um i'm not for glitter and these i don't know if you're gonna be able to tell but these have a lot of glitter on them and when my guests come over they leave with a a ton of glitter all over them and um so i'm gonna refabric these pillows and i'm gonna get the fabric from walmart and i'm gonna redo them and i'm gonna show you guys how i did it once i do it but that's the only thing I don't like about this couch is the pillows and I tried taking them off but the couch just looks so bare without those pillows so I leaving them on for now but in a couple of days I'm fabricing them and I will let you know I will update you on how that looks <laughs> so yeah that's just basically our living room it's it's pretty we're pretty simple you know we just have our fridge for when guests come over and they want some water or something and like some different variety of drinks in there and then um our tv and our stand is all we need really in here <laughs> and then here is where our dining room is supposed to be but i decided um not to make it not, not to make it a dining area just yet um i'm not exactly sure what i want to do with this area just yet so all that's here is a little chair right there <laughs> but i will figure it out i'm just i just don't know yet and I'm gonna take you guys into our bathroom. Yeah, our room is right here, but I'm not gonna show my room because I'm gonna do a separate room tour sometime in the future. Um, I'll keep you guys posted on that, but right now um, my room is a mess and I really wanna get everything together. I'm still getting, trying to find things to decorate it with, so bear with me on that. <laughs> but. Before I show you the bathroom, I want to show you our linen closet. So this is our linen closet in the hallway. And it's, we have sliding doors, two sliding doors. And on this side, we have some extra pillows for when we have guests over or sleep like guests that's staying over with us. And then we have an iron, some extra soap, some soap dishes, and some uh, chargers for our phones. And here we just have, I don't know, like random stuff. And then on the bottom is just stuff I use to clean my my room and my um, living room and the rest of the area. Like this is stuff I use to clean with and some detergent. And then down here is what I consider my junk drawer. <laughs> it has all of my bills and all of my uh, papers, important papers that I need. And then our vacuum cleaner, which is a Bissell. Got it from this, everything I keep there. And then on the other side, I keep most of my body sprays and deodorants that I want to have close to the bathroom, but not exactly in the bathroom. So yeah, I just have some face uh, masks, some um, toner, some face toner, some deodorants, some moisturizers, body sprays, uh, shave gel, stuff like that. And then the bottom, the next one has nothing. And the t one above that has nothing. And then I just have my flat iron and this black pad that I use to wash my brushes on. It's kind of rubbery and it has like holes in it. And it's very uh, useful for deep cleaning my brushes. And I just have some backup toothpaste. And then my fiance has his clippers and his uh, stuff to cut his hair with. And we just have toilet paper and a fan that needs to be cleaned. <laughs> and then our bathroom is basically like a tan marsala themed bathroom <laughs> and um yeah so i got all of this stuff that you're seeing in here from the dollar store everything the curtain came in a set with the hand towels and um the liquid soap over there dispenser and they all came in a set for like 
twenty dollars or so at the dollar store and then i have a four spread a four set of rugs two on the toilet and then two on also came from the dollar store for like 10 bucks and then on top i have a tray that came from the dollar store for four dollar and and then i have a stick up deodorizer on my toilet <laughs> and three poofs one from the bath and body works the one in the middle is from bath and body works and then the two on the side are from the dollar store and and i just have my liner that i got from walgreens it's a regular liner and then um this is what my tub looks like i love it and i just have my um shampoo and conditioner on the side there i have my mat and I'm um, sorry if it's getting darker, <laughs> but I just have, you know, the necessities you need in your shower. Shave gel, shower gel. Um, that's my fiance's stuff at the bottom. And then this is my stuff at the top. And that back scrubber is also mine. But he has that blue one and then all of his stuff on this side right here. So, yeah. And in this picture I said I got from the dollar store for like $6. It says, look well, laugh often, and love much. And I just thought it went really well with our bathroom. And on the side here, I just have a toilet brush and a plunger. And then I have some air freshener and two types of soap, liquid and solid. And my fiance's uh, handheld mirror from when he cuts his hair and um, just necessities that you need um girl stuff and like some hair stuff and some cotton rounds and my cleaning supplies for my bathroom now inside here i just have some extra liquid soap and that's basically everything that's in our bathroom um at the moment um that's that's how i decorated my bathroom 